What up, 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 world? It's your boy Amp Dog with another episode of Politicking. I want to thank everybody for tuning in, showing your love, and uh, make sure you tell a friend to tell a friend. Big Amp Dog said, What's the deal? And today we got a, we got, we got to talk about Brother Polite. And um, I'm going to say off the rip, this is all allegations. It's alleged. I ain't seen nothing from uh, any, you know, police uh, statements or any investigators or anything. Um, I haven't seen none of that. This is strictly uh, Tasha K. Um, she got the intel. She dropped it. And I've just been seeing people talk about it. So me... My whole point of this video is not necessarily to talk about the allegations. Well, yeah, it's to talk about the allegations, but not necessarily place blame. I just want to give my what ifs, because if this is true, you know, um, there's a special place for people like that, you know, um, and not to mention just the the type of character, you know, you 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 portray in that in that you. Um, put out there to the public, you know, this, this could be very, very, very bad. And, um, just because, you know, uh, we see different things like this happen all the time where, you know, it could be just you and your girl got into it and then she want to place an allegation on you. But like I said, I haven't seen any of the, of the, of the actual, paperwork or documentation but if it's true what they said as far as they got dna evidence um just the the i just want to be able to see if you even been locked up and released and hit bail for this shit so that's the reason why you get a pass on this video but best believe we're gonna follow up you know what i'm saying um but since we're here, let's talk about, you know, the allegations of what's going on is pretty much uh, Mr. Polite uh, came to the mother, Mrs. Or Orocho, Orocho, Mrs. Orocho, and um, he's 38. Ms. Orocho is 31, and they were in a relationship for just over a year. And Miss Orocho had a four, she got a 14 year old daughter, you know. So, what is being told is basically he had hit up the mother to try to have some type of conversation with the daughter to try to mend the mother and daughter relationship. Which, again, they got a special place for people like this. If this is true, I don't want to say anything until I see an official report um facts i just want to see the facts but hypothetical hypothetically if this is true um what they are alleging you my friend are a cruel person and you would then be the reason why we as a society look at people like you with like a kind of like a side eye you know, it's no different than the preacher, you know, um, that that that'll sit there and, and pray for you, but then pray on you, you know. Um, so that's the reason why I wanted to talk about this situation, because, bro, like, the shit that you were doing, quote unquote, as far as the shit that you would talk about and how you were just so positive and oh, uplifting the, the community, hey, we do all of that. You know, so if 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 you out doing that, but then behind closed doors you doing this, yeah, 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 yeah. It's a wrap, and I and and like it's even said that, you know, he got her intoxicated, under the influence of drugs, possibly. You know, um, tried to stick her finger, stick his finger down her throat to make her regurgitate, like throw up, or. I guess that's a, a case of trying to sober her up. I guess I don't know, but the fact of the matter is, um, she's fourteen. So I'm not gonna pass judgment on a mother until, like I said, we get the facts. But I don't see where a 38 year old and a 14 year old need to be 
going anywhere together to talk about I don't I don't know. It just don't make sense. So that's the reason why I'm gonna hold my real true thoughts and judgment. Um but you know to to then tell the mother allegedly that don't call nobody or authorities because it could ruin your career. Um this will let me know that this is not the first time that you potentially have done something like this. This may be a habit that finally somebody didn't care about your status or your or um your position in the public eye um to where now they they expose it you know um I also heard a story about because I'm gonna be real like i i i don't i I've never really followed brother polite I've seen certain things like little clips and videos of certain things that he say and um yeah he he he's a pro black proactive but if you praying on your own people you know whether she black or not like you praying on children um there's a special fucking place for people like y'all um but anyway i heard you know a story about his his uh daughter was 13 and came up missing you know she was found, thankfully, but I, 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 I'm trying to find more research on that story to where, like, did she run away? You know, so it's like, like, was she telling somebody something years before and she wasn't being heard to where this could have saved this, this young 14-year-old from having her life ruined? You know, because um, her, her innocence is gone. She, it's, it's a wrap, you know, um... I just want to see what the what the what the details come out from like some type of arrest record or something, you know. Um, shout out to Tasha K because at least she got the awareness out there, and um, you know I don't, I don't care what your stature or position is, you know you got to protect the baby. So if you out here doing the opposite, then we gonna expose it and we gonna talk about it. But you get a pass, this video. You get a pass, this video, just due to the fact that everything ain't came out yet, you know? I haven't seen any official court documents or anything like that. I'm not connected like how Tasha K is to where she probably got all that. And she gonna hold off on it, but we gonna see. But, um... Yeah, man, y'all y'all like, share, subscribe. Shout out to all the new subscribers. Uh, drop y'all thoughts in the comment. What y'all think? Y'all y'all think this is just an attack on a on a on a black man that's that's out here trying to make it? Cause I heard a response from him on Sonetta's, uh show where he he basically was you know insinuating that this is just some bullshit and and it's a, an attack on you know on him you know so. I don't know. We we shall see. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments. Um, I'll be down there. You know. Um, yeah, we we can't have people like this in, in position of power or being in, in position of influence that's doing stuff like this to our children. You know, or our women. You know, like we gotta we gotta be able to understand and cut motherfuckers off. Like, don't support it. I don't care how good his message was. You see where it's coming from. You found the source of why he talked the way he talked. You know? Same thing with people like the lesser charge. You know? Like, people like that. It's a special place for people like that. You know? Especially when they thrive in it. So he's been thriving in it. Allegedly. But anyway, man, tell a friend to tell a friend. Big Amp Dog said, what's the deal? And uh, as always, no matter who the f it is, protect your kids. Protect yourself. And that's always protect your peace. Peace.